All right, so I'm creating a Squarespace email campaign series, which is something that I've never done. So I thought I would uh, hit record and let you in on the process. So I'm using a property here that I have called Squarespace Guru, and I've created this um, email series called uh, The Seven Ingredients to Squarespace Guruhood. And it's a newsletter block, and I'm going to connect the storage to Squarespace uh, campaigns. Um, I haven't set anything up, so I'm, I'm doing this entirely from scratch here. Um, yeah, I don't have any mailing list, so it says if no mailing list is selected, you can still find your subscribers in profiles. So let me click on profiles and see what that allows me to do. Okay, so I can turn your site traffic into subscribers. All right what I want I guess um, add a promotional pop-up or import existing subscribers so this takes me to I guess how to use the newsletter block which I'm pretty familiar with um, but my question in the moment is how to create a mailing list so let me go to leads um, and I don't see an obvious way to do that. Okay, so create a mailing list from email campaigns. All right. I'm learning on the fly. Here we go. Um, so create and create a mailing list, and now I can do that. Awesome. So uh, it would be cool if I could have gotten there straight from here. Straight on over to here. But maybe next time. All right, so new mailing list. Your mailing list name is public and your subscribers will be able to see it. All right, so uh, Squarespace Guru Hood. Um, now, there's probably not going to be any other list here, but just in case, I thought it might be useful to use that. And then now let's try and see. Here we go. Cool. Learn something already. All right, so now, um, so now what happens when someone signs up? So let's go back on over to campaigns. And uh, my guess is we're gonna need to create uh, an automation. So let's do the, the welcome email because I want people to get this as soon as they sign up. So let's see. Keep it simple. I'm going to use Hester. And uh, yeah, so use this template. And I've already prepped my email a bit. It probably needs some, some tweaking, but um, that's okay. We can do that. So here it is. Here's the email that's going to kick it off. Copy that, and uh, let's paste that over here. And that looks like a big chunk of text, which no one wants to read that. So uh, let's call this what it is, the seven, seven, seven ingredients to. All right, so email is done. Um, now see what the next step is so style i'm just going to leave this as is and and okay so when a si person signs up for your site send this email see what the custom options are so i can delay this by what just by days okay so let's say two days can i do that cool all right that's satisfactory um, we're going <coughs> to do this immediately and then, uh, yeah, so send this immediately. Um, hmm, so all subscribers are just this particular mailing list. 
we're going to just pick this melon list and that's it so okay so to activate this I almost didn't see this down here I had to scroll um, I have to activate automation so I have to upgrade to the campaigns plan which I will do uh, let's send a test can we do that so I need to add a subject line almost forgot that okay cool so let's just What is this of of? All right, and let's send the test. Um, cool. So let me see what that looks like. It's pretty good. All right, so I'm happy with it. Um, now let's activate our automation. So let's upgrade. And this is going to take me to the checkout. Uh, select a plan. Uh, let's see. So what is this? 48 bucks a month for the starter plan. I can send three campaigns a month. Zero automated campaigns. All right. So I'm going to need the... Um, I'm going to need the core plan here. Cool. I'm ready to send my first campaign. This is done. And so I've got one automation set up now. Uh, I need to add sender details. Okay. So this is something I hadn't done. So sender name Omari. And here's my email. Um, after after adding you <coughs> sender details, make sure to verify your domain. Okay. So they just sent some type of verification to me. Okay, perfect. So now, uh, what is this certification or verification options? Um, I'm not going to turn that on right now. All right, so now my checklist is complete. Um, looks like I'm ready to go. I've already created this first automation. Um, and let's see, it says paused. Why does it say paused? Oh, because I have to click activate. All right, so now I'm going to activate our automation. And... I need to enter an address here. I didn't see that before. Uh, let's see. Here we go. All right, cool. So now let's test this out and see if we get this email. All right, so I got the email. Um, it went to my promotions folder. So I will... Um, probably add some type of language to say, hey, move this out of your promotion folder just to make sure you get it. Um, so hopefully you found this useful. Um, I'll probably do some type of follow up as I use email campaigns a little bit more. Um, but hopefully this is enough to help you get started as it's helped me get started. Um, anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.